Hi, welcome to Little Hatchin Park with him where they drink when they drink cookie. From? Wild Kratz. Yeah. We've been drawing Wild Kratz characters all this week and today we're going to draw Koki. She has curly hair and so do you, huh? I, <laughs> you have it in an Elsa braid today, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's not curly. It's curly at the bottom. I have some earrings. Yeah, like me, huh? <laughs> Your sister gave you some stick on earrings, huh? Should we draw? Let's get drawing. Start with her huh. eyes. We've got one eye here. And then the other eye over here. And then inside is the people. I did. Okay. And then she's got eyebrows up here. And then her nose is kind of like just three little bumps, bumps down there. And then her doing it. Oh, you Oopsie. forgot her pupil over there. All right. And Look then her smile, smile is like this. And then an upside down rainbow. And then, <laughs> well, well, oh, good job. Yep, and I need to do my line in the I'm going to do eyelashes. Yep, eyelashes right here. I'm going right to do her eyelashes, big. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Good How time. long are you going to do her head? All right. Well, let's see. First, we're going to do her headband. She's got a headband that goes like this. So you make a rainbow shape. And then another rainbow shape next to it. And then her ear is right here. And she's got some earrings. One, two. And then a big pearl earring right there. Okay, and then her chin goes to there. Well, I mean, her neck is right there, and then the other One, side of her two, neck is right three, there. Three. And then it goes around, and it meets up with the headband. I'm gonna do him. He's them to her ears. Good and job. Now her neck. Good job. Okay, now let's do her awesome hair. So we're gonna do these rainbow shapes all around. Don't do it on her headband. Yeah, not on her headband. But I like it, do it on her headband. Okay. Rainbows are sun, right? Yep, and then that all needs to be filled in black. Do you wanna do that right now? You want to do it later? Okay, so later when we're coloring, we're going to fill in all of her hair black. And then she's also got some curly bangs that come down like this. I don't want to. I'm going to do it later. Okay, I'm showing her bangs that go down next to her eyebrows. Okay, now we're going to do freckles later when we're coloring. She's got some brown freckles on her face. I want to do it. No, you want to do it with a lighter color instead of black, okay? All right, so now her shoulder, it goes up like this and then down. Oh, you're doing her freckles right now. Okay, so we need to draw her shirt. So we did her shoulder right here. <laughs> Can you do her shoulder? It goes up and then down. And then her sleeve is like this. And this all gets colored in black too. And then her waist goes in right here and then out for her hip. Does her sleeve go like this? Yeah, and then we're gonna draw her hand. So we've got one finger here and then two fingers going down. Good job. Okay, so now we're gonna draw her arm. It makes a triangle shape. It goes up and then over like that. Could you help me? And then we draw the other right next to it. It's just like a triangle. 
and then from here up to there. Good. And then you just do the same thing next to it so that, yeah, perfect. Yes. Good job. Good arm. You did awesome. Okay. So now should we draw the star on her shirt? I'm going to draw it with pen because this marker kind of bleeds a little bit. Can I do it? You want to make a star? Good job. All right. And now we're going to draw her other shoulder. And then, oops. <laughs> And then Could it goes do down. Me? Yeah, I will. And let me just show this. So that's the bottom of her shirt. And then her arm comes down right next to it, like that. And then we'll draw her hand in just a second. Okay. Good. And then back up to that hand. Good job. All right. And then let's draw one more line right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to draw her thumb. All right. So I drew her thumb right here and then her fingers, it just shows this one finger going down. Okay. Good job. Okay. So now let's do her legs. So from here, we're going to go down for her knee. Okay. So just, yeah. So this leg is slightly bent and I'm drawing her other leg. No, those are good. You're doing so good. All right. And then I'm going to draw this line coming down, it tapers in a little bit at the knee and then it goes back out. And then there's a little wrinkle at the bottom. Okay, well, let me finish it and then we can restart it if we need to, okay? I want to. Okay, just let me finish mine first. And then over here, we're gonna draw up. And it tapers in at the knee and then it gets wider at the hip, like that. And then right here, she has a pocket. And then it comes down. And then her shoe goes out like that and back over. And then this leg, the shoe comes, curves out there, comes forward, back up. And then we've got one wrinkle right there. And other than that, it is done. All right, here's a quick time lapse of my daughter redoing her Koki, and then we're gonna color it together in time lapse, and you can pause it after this, and you can be able to get a reference for how to color your Koki. We're done with our Koki. Right now we're done. Pause it here. I'm so impressed that you drew Koki so well. That was good. I hope you had fun drawing Koki and I would love to see how yours turns out. Have your parents tag me at Sarah Hatch Art Studio on Instagram and have them show me your awesome drawings. And me too. And I'll show them to her. All right, we will see you next time. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss our future videos. Bye.